What's this? Activate Diva. Oh. 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 <laughs> what a goddamn shame. Good evening, good evening, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back. Um, I think it's high time we took another look at Skyrim. I mean, I have played this game an awful lot, and I'm sure you guys have as well. I mean, I've yet to find a gamer who actually hasn't played Skyrim yet. But today in particular, what we're doing is we're playing modded survival mode. Now, uh, survival mode at the moment is free, free through the Creation Club, which I just downloaded. I think they're going to start charging for it soon. It's like a kind of like a late DLC. And um, I believe the same is true for Fallout, although I'm not 100% sure. Um, I'll have to go check that out as well. Um, and as far as I'm aware, that kind of like it increases the difficulty and gives you like um, food like re requirements and like you know like thirst requirements and stuff like that. I'm not entirely sure, but I'm excited to kind of find out. And this is heavily modded, and some of you may know this, but some of you may not. Um, when you mod Skyrim, the kind of start is really buggy. So I had to install a mod that gives us a different start. Um, so we'd be starting from a different place, kind of like a different lore and whatnot. Um, so things will be slightly different, although it's the same old Skyrim that we love. Um, now, there's not too many mods in It's not like my Fallout playthrough. So um, I figured as we go through, as we kind of like, um, I guess, develop the playthrough, there is a possibility we can we can always install other mods. If you guys have some suggestions, make sure to leave them in the comment section or like message me or whatever. And if they're, if they're good enough, I can add them in. It's cool. All the mods are actually um, that I'm using at the moment are in the description, so you want to check those out. That's cool. Anyway, without further ado, let's start. Um, I've, I've, I've got a game running at the moment, but it's, it's like basically just testing the start and make sure everything's all loaded up fine. So we're going to start a new game and we're going to create a character. Okay, so we start off with our race editor, as opposed to um, doing it uh, while we're being, you know, like, executed or whatever. Um, so we've got an option. We can go, right, so let's go up to the top and see what we've got here. Oh, we got fucking hell. Uh, yeah, we go. Right, okay, so we can start with Argonian, which is the lizard people. Um, Breton. There's nothing new added in, I don't think, is there? Who is that fellow? He's looking a bit rotten, isn't he? High Elves, Imperial. I always tend to go with Imperial, to be honest with you. I know it's kind of, um, yeah, a bit, a bit safe, isn't it, really? Or maybe Nord. Or should we have Orc? I don't really like Orcs, if I'm honest. Uh, Red Guard as well, and we got Wood Elves, um, which look really weird. <laughs> but there's plenty of races to choose from. Uh, I'm going to go with... I'm going to go with Nord. Keep it, like, keep it safe, I suppose. Uh, for the body, um, I think... I think, therefore, I, um, um, okay, the, the sex slider is just non-responsive. There we go. Uh, we're doing a man or woman. I kind of like, the men look really weird in all of Skyrim, I think. So I'm going to go for a female one. Just looks less weird, I think. I think they've spent a bit more time on the field models than they did on the male ones. They just look kind of clunky, really. Um, should we just go with the preset? I think it doesn't really matter all that much, does it? Because we're not going to see them that often. I don't want to spend too much time customising the character. Uh, maybe we'll come back in later on and kind of, like, do it. Uh, yeah, that'll do, I suppose. Yeah, skin tone. Maybe a little bit darker. They are out in the, out in the wilderness quite a lot, aren't they? And, um... So, like, an average build, I suppose. <laughs> Somewhere in the middle. Okay, so, um... What do we do there? If we click the buttons, go left or right, it's a bit hard, like the hitboxes are quite small. Uh, I'm going to leave that all as it is. Eyes, brow, mouth, yep, yeah, hair. Um, I'm okay with all that. Should we do? Oh, R is done, so we're done. Finish? Sure. I need to name a character. I'll call it Lily. Bob's your uncle. And we are done! So, a second chance. So, we are in a prison. Oh, hello. That's the um, statue of Murray. Isn't that like Approach the um? Approach my child and choose where your new life shall begin. Okay. Oh, all these things are being activated. Arrived aboard a ship. I own a property in the holds. I am a member of a guild. I am a patron of a local inn. I am a soldier in an army. Um, I got caught crossing the border illegally. Uh, that's a vanilla start. It doesn't work very. It doesn't work. It gyps out like crazy. I want to escape the cell. Uh, I'm an outlaw in the wilds. I'm a vigilant uh, stendar. Oh, I don't know what that is. I'm camping in the woods. I am um, shipwrecked off the coast. I'm a vampire in a secluded lair. I am a necromancer in a secret location. I am a warlock's thrall. 
I think it's really cool. I'm really, really into a lot of these. I was attacked and left for dead. Um, I am Eric, the Slayer's childhood friend. Who's Eric the Slayer? Um, was he? Is he like the leader? I can't, I can't remember honestly. It's been so long. Um, I kind of like the idea of where is it um, I am a necromancer in a secret location now I thought about just like kind of escaping from here it is kind of dull though once you get out of here you just kind of like in the middle of nowhere you left your own devices so I want to try one of these different starting areas the and see what we do here undead, necromancer. Use the statue to choose a new life for yourself. Um, use the empty um, bed to begin your new life. Okay, so should we have a just quick quick look around to see if there's anything we can pitch from here? It might be useful. Maybe something in the barrels. Um, this is special edition, by the way. That's the bed. Doesn't look like there's anything else. It's running quite smoothly, actually. It's quite nice. I have had some upgrades on my computer and stuff, so it is running quite quite fresh. And you nice new processor and stuff like that, so... Right, where do we start? Okay, so here we go. We got free shit. Um, read it, sure. Uh, begin your new life. I guess I'll take it. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, lots of stuff, lots of flowers and stuff. I guess this is more for her herbology or what do they call it? Um, in the olden days, it's alchemy, wasn't it? Transmutation of materials and stuff. Alchemy. Yeah. Um, was that a Deidre heart. Ooh, shit, that's expensive. So we got a nice little start here. We get kick started off with, um, ooh, there they are. Dwarven arrows. Uh, looks like someone's been killed by a dwarf. <laughs> some plates. That's a chest, isn't it? It is indeed. Uh, petty soul gem and some necklaces, which we can enchant, can't we? Uh, let's see, we go back. Good stuff. What is that noise? I can hear something like vibrating or something. Um, I'll take the torch. Thank you. Um, and the, is that a pack? Or is that just some scenery? Search knapsack, here we go. Okay, so, uh, Argarian account book, three, um, a potion of minor healing, red apple, clothes, uh, copper onyx circlet, and boots. Right, now, of course, this is survival mode, so I'm not entirely sure what that's going to mean in the long run. So, why don't we, um, how are we going to do this? Would it be out of skills, maybe? No, it wouldn't be. Um, items, no, it's, I know there's, like, kind of indicators in magic. Active effects. Here we go. Um, fortify sneak. Um, I guess being well fed and stuff like that actually helps you. Regenerate magicka. Uh, and but when you're starving and stuff like that, a little indicator will come up here saying, you know, like your your effects have been reduced due to blah 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 blah. Anyway, uh, let's take these spell tombs. Oh, okay, so we've got all our necromancer stuff. I'll take that. And scroll of the anorak or whatever the hell that said <laughs> uh, some boots of hauling good i love lots of carry space it is my fave it is my jam um some actual jam oh it's a chest let's see uh, banded armor iron armor war axe lock picks oh and a ring so shall we gear up then uh, we've got plenty of items now uh, let's see apparel Okay, so we could go with armor 30. Um, what's this? Boost of sneaking we've got at the moment. Sneaking is 20% better. And increases magicka by... Tw oh, we actually were already wearing clothes. What were we wearing before? I don't know. We were wearing something. Shit, we've actually got a lot of items already. Uh, maybe they're just standard old clothes. Unenchanted. Ah, uh, okay, see, that's all unenchanted, isn't it? Armor 30. And that's armor 27. Of course, armor isn't the best thing. Uh, I'm going to do that because I prefer carrying it than sneaking at the moment, at least. Uh, I'm going to drop that because that's just garbage. Um, more armor. Oh, so here we go. Minor robes of... Sorry, mi robes of minor conjuring. Conjuring spells cost 20% less magicka. Uh, regenerates 50% faster. Do we want to... Uh, I think we kind of want that, maybe? For the minute, at least? Until we can get some better... S the thing is, like, spell clothes are difficult. But once you get to the... Um, uh, what was it? The, the, the school... You, once you complete that chest, chest queen. I always say chest queen for some reason. My dyslexia is coming out like real raw today. Um, that quest chain. <laughs> um, you can get some decent like um, actual cloth armor. Okay, so uh, what else do we want to do? Weapons. Uh, so we've got some arrows, and we've got a war axe, and we've got a staff of mage light. Balls of light that last 60 seconds and sticks where it uh, strikes. So we can kind of go left and right. So we can go. Yep. So we can go, oh no, it's backwards isn't it, it's reversed. So we go like that, and then we've got some light there and we can cut some shit up. That's actually pretty badass. Um, let's take the rest of this stuff. Right, so I'm just going to loot up a second. And then, uh, oh, we can actually enchant some stuff. 
We look pretty cool. Um, okay, so I'm just going to kind of like loot this room and stuff like that. You don't want to be around for that. So I'm going to take what I need. Okay, so we're all done here. I pretty much picked up everything I need. Uh, I think we got some food and stuff as well. So if we, if we need food, we've got food. And I've got like random bits of herbs and stuff so we can kickstart our alchemy. Okay, so survival mode. Survival allows the need to eat, sleep, and stay warm. It also adds additional challenges such as no fast travel. Oh, shit. Reduce carry weight and leveling up only when you sleep. Oh, so it's like an, an aggregate. Where have I seen that before? Where you only level up when you sleep. Like Stargy Valley or something? I don't know. I can't remember. Anyway, uh, see the survival mode for extra help. Okay, so enable survival mode. Yes, I do want to enable survival mode. Um, so the one thing that kind of like mm, is a bit, I don't know, maybe we might have to mod it in is no fast travel because this game is flipping huge and without fast travel it might be a bit difficult. But it might mean prior prioritizing certain... Um, certain missions and stuff, and maybe doing more stuff where we are. So that might be actually quite fun. Anyway, here we go. Who's this fella? Oh shit, he's attacking me. Uh, okay. Oh, I know where we are. Oh my fucking god. Wow. Uh, okay. <laughs> We're like really high level. Um, there's no way I'm going to be able to fight this guy. This is like really... This is advanced stuff. Why, why am I here, man? Maybe I can kind of like hunt this guy. No, nope, he's got me. Okay, so two shots, he's going to get me bad. Um, okay, this is probably not the best place I could have started. But you live and you learn, don't you? Um, so let's... How do, why am I running? Okay, that's fine. I thought shift normally runs. Uh, the air is warm here. Okay, that's good. That's good. The air is warm. I got a little icon there. Is um, temperature. You feel warmer and are now comfortable. Good stuff. Good stuff. What's this? Activate lever. Woo! Oh. 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 <laughs> what a goddamn shame. So I guess today we are trying to get home, aren't we? We are trying to get home. We're trying to get on, on the track to completely end the game. Um, so we can maybe pick up the trail a little bit. Uh, I'm kind of in a room. <laughs> It's just, this is an interesting little room. Anyway, it's gotten me out of combat, so that's a good thing, I suppose. Uh, map. Where do we see... I, I always struggle with this menu. Um, let me see. It would be under... Where would I find? Here we go. For some reason, quests are on escape as opposed to in the menu. Uh, return to your roots. Discover the significance of Nin Root. Um, no, we don't want that. So live a lover life. Begin your new life. This lab is uh, running out of supplies soon. My research has proven fruitless anyway. And these... Oh, so I actually remember this room now. Now I think about it. They didn't actually add that room in. That room was always there. And the Falmer are out there. are not getting any less aggressive. I need to make my way back to the surface. Hopefully without too much trouble. From there, only the gods um, well, may know. But I cannot stay here much longer. The Crimson Inn route in the uh, Cinderian's field notes. Cinderians? Cinderians? Probably, I don't know. Uh, will be of interest to someone. I do hope that uh, damn Dwemer sphere that showed up outside my door has left. I'll need to be on guard just in case it's still there. So we need to bring in our new life. And uh, Sophia's tracking marker. I don't know what that is. Anyway, we're going to do live another life. And, um, and we're going to follow where we need to go. I don't know. It's, it's just like a quest. But no direction. So... Maybe it just means we need to get out of here. Some sort of indicator would be nice, though. Um, we are in snack <coughs> mode. Snacking. Snacking all over the shop. Um, can we... Can we get him when he walks over? Uh... 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 Can we reload it? Oh, that's a shame, isn't it? Hang on a second. Let's go back out and come back in again. Okay, so my snack has gone up. All right, I'm hoping. This doesn't seem to be reloaded. I'm really hoping I haven't fucked this up, like, royally. Wait, I am drained. Ooh, okay, so I need to eat food, don't I? Uh, you feel better. You are now satisfied. Okay. Um... This dude here, I'd rather him kind of rock up to that door so we can deal with him. Come on, come on, rock up to the door. Rock up to the door. So actually, just standing here is actually leveling my sneak up. Oh crap, someone's seen me. Or someone's... 
I am peckish. Oh, he gets hungry quite quickly, doesn't he? Maybe it's because I'm sneaking. Maybe because I'm actively sneaking, it's making me more hungry. Um, I don't know how to get out of here. How the fuck do I get out of here? I can't remember. The way I came in here was probably not the way I was supposed to come in here. Well, originally, when I, when I first played. It was quite difficult. Um, something can see me, and I don't know what. I think it might be that robot. Um, I came in, like, through a the ceiling? Maybe that is the way, I don't know. Uh, but it's not the way I'm escaping. <laughs> Let me tell you. Um, and this way doesn't seem to be an exit. Can we activate another quest, maybe? Um, begin your new knife. Um, it doesn't really allow me to... It doesn't give me a direction to travel in. Um, Sophia tracking marker. Maybe that's what I needed. Maybe that's what I just opened up the console. Okay, so, yeah, I think that probably is what I need. So let's, um... Let's carry on being a snack. And, um... Oh, shit, I've been detected. Woo-doo! This guy! Fuck you, I'm only level one! I need to get out of here, man! <laughs> oh, no! Where are we? Is this a nin route, is it? Nin your route. Right, okay, here we go. How the fuck do we get... Uh... Uh... Someone's proper woke. How the fuck do I get behind there? Let's learn some of these spells then. Uh, Conjure Familiar, um, Lesser Ward, and Raise Zombie. Okay, right now we can equip some magic. Let's see, Conjuring. Um, we want to raise some zombies, don't we? On the right. Wait, left? Oh, fuck, I don't fucking know. <laughs> Come on, zombie! Fight for me! Wait, where's my zombie? Zombie! Where are you? Kill this Falmer! I'm out of mana. I don't think I had enough mana to conjure one zombie. <laughs> oh, useless. Uh, do I have any other magics? Wait, so what does it cost? Um, it costs... 79, and I only have 15. So I wasn't even close, was I? Um, <laughs> fucking hell. Uh, I got flames, though. But that can do, like... One little blast. If I do left and then on the right hand I do a weapon, I can maybe I can maybe get this done. Wait, what's this dagger? Probably dagger would be best, wouldn't it? Oh shit! I did the wrong thing. Oh shit, this is bad, this is bad, this is bad, this is bad! And I died. Oh god, this is really hard. I'm getting the hang of it though. Um, oh god, I need to get out of here. I really need to get out. Here we go, he's a little bit glitched, so I'm just going to take advantage and burn the bastard to a, to a crisp. Uh, oh, that was not coming at me. Oh, what the fuck?! Really? I can get one-shotted by this guy. Oh my god. There we go. Now he's gonna die. Come on. Fucking die. Fucking die. There we go. Fantastic. He actually killed the damn thing. Uh, you got a Thalma sword, a ear, uh, a something, a thing, and, a and another thing. Yay! I got things! <laughs> All of the things. Right, now please don't have that robot kill me. Damn robot. Okay, right, so uh, fatigue. You are tired, which reduces the total amount of magicka represented by a dark region in the magicka bar. Okay, so this little bar, a bit at the bottom here, introduces, I guess, um, tiredness, which is pretty cool. Um, I need to... Here we go, here's the lift, because the lift button was literally just there the whole time. That's fine, let's get out of here, man. Let's get out of here and follow our destiny. Great lift. Something of... Yeah, great lift of elf tanned. Elf tans, yeah, the lift of elf tan. Um, lever. Now let's not get attacked by wolves. Thank you. Um, we got a little bit of magic, and we got a little sword. Um, oh, hello, right, dude. Take this and hold on to it. I'll be back. Minor health added. Oh shit, hungry. I am chilly and I am packish. Uh, you're hungry, which reduces the total amount of stamina. Yeah, we know all this. So this guy just gave us a potion, and I'm cold as well. Later. I'll pay you good. This don't lose it. Fugitive. No time what? to talk. Snitch or double cross me and I'll kill you. I mean it. Or I could just fuck you up right now. Whatever. So this dude here is an asshole and he's just giving us stuff to um 
He's a fugitive. So we've just given us some stuff um, to hold on to while, I guess, he runs away. I don't know, there's a bone there. It's really weird. Right, so where are we going then? Okay, uh, let's open up the Maparoni and let's... I reckon we should go to Winterhold. Um, or should we just kind of head down into an area where we might be a little safer? Like, maybe we should head down into White Run. Ah, oh, the names, the names, they're coming back to me. This feels so much like Game of Thrones as well. The icons and the landscape and stuff like that, and the little map. Oh, it's so good! It's so good! Uh, oh, shit! See someone run past just now. Uh, yeah! He went that way. Great. Thanks. Bastard stole from me. I'll catch him, though. Good! Kill that fucker! I'm keeping his potions. Now he's shooting. I'm burning him! I'm burning him! I want this stuff, man. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. He died like a little bitch. Uh, I got the Iron Mace, some gold, and some armor, I guess? And he's nud. He's in the nuddy. Is that a metal plate on his ass? That's... That's a thing. <laughs> okay. That's definitely a thing. We need to sleep, and we need to eat, and we need to get out of the cold. Oh, darn, it is so cold. It might be a bit difficult walking that out that distance in the snow when we're tired and hungry and stuff. Why don't we stop off in that little cabin? I think that'll be a great place to have a little kip. Kip, kip, kip. Come on. We haven't really made it that far, have we? We started the game, we got stuck for a little bit, and now we're here. Ooh, it's chilly. Ooh, needs to start a fire. Maybe we could, maybe we could like, use our spell power to start a fire. No? Oh, it's, it's an actual inn. That's good news, isn't it? Maybe we can have a little kip here as well. Oh, 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 the warm, the warm. I love it. Can we, like, stand in the fire? Like, hey, we're warming up. Um, can I have a room for the night, my good man? Ah, hello there, traveler. I'd like to rent a room. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. Sure is, dude. Um, did I even have 10 sure gold? <laughs> do I? How much money do I have? Uh, I have 314 gold. I do have like enough. Uh, the room is mine for a day. Hi, Ara. Mm -hmm. uh, heard any rumors lately? Travel to... Okay, but well, she didn't actually say anything, but I need to travel to Helgen. Uh, excuse me. Huh? Huh? Um... I don't want to. Okay, so she. I. I. I no. No. Let, let's. Let's go back. I. I'm not going to pay to have sex with her. That's. Um. That's for private time. Okay. I'm going to go sleep now. Goodbye. No, wait. Yeah. It's owned because it's owned by me, isn't it? Um. I don't know. Oh shit! I stole it. <laughs> I really didn't mean to do that. Uh. I got a little mod installed. And it tells me all the books I've read. It's pretty cool, eh? Um, that way you're not kind of opening all the box up. And for some reason, out of a sense of completion, I feel like I must at least look at all of the books, even though I'm not reading them. Uh, I don't know why. Uh, some of the books, I think, have things, don't they? Like um, spells and stuff, or like um, quests and whatnot. So it's, I think it's better to kind of read them than not need it. Okay, I think it's about time to call it a night then, isn't it? Uh, we got, it's like funny, there's all this stuff here. Like, there's chests, uh, wardrobe, and there's a beer on the table and whatnot. Um, and the room's mine, but I can't touch any of it. Oh, dear me. So how long are we going to sleep for? It's um, it's 1pm. I think that's been a quite an eventful day. So why don't we sleep for 19 hours? <laughs> Have a proper rest, yeah? Just sleep for it all. Sleep through the day. Sleep through the night. Wake up nice and early in the morning. And then go on an adventure. Oh shit, am I gonna... It's gonna be fine, isn't it? Yeah, it's gonna be 8 o'clock in the morning. How perfect is that? Oh, I feel... Oh, oh. I'm quite hungry. I'm quite hungry. Why don't we buy some food? Something I can get for you? What have you got for sale? Stranger. Uh, I need... I need some food, yo. Um, some baked potatoes. I'll take them. I'll take some bread. Mmm, nice. Obviously, some stuff like cooked beef is better for, for food than other things. Um, but we need a good old healthy supply of food. So why don't we take some more... Uh, how much is that? I don't... What am I buying here? Value 12. Okay, there we go. Uh, why don't we have a nice big jug of milk as well? And um, while we're at it, we'll drink some wine. So we're going to... Oh, no, no. No, I'm good, thanks. Anything See you later, dude. Right, let's have, a, let's have a sit down. Enjoy our meal. 
What am I wearing? <laughs> like, bartender, give me some food. I don't know. Uh, items. Uh, we need food. Right, so I think we're waking up. We want we want something to drink, right? So we'll have a nice big jug of milk. Then we'll have... It's, it's the morning time, so maybe we'll have a bit of bread. And um, we'll have an apple. And um, what else are we going to have? A bit of chicken? Yeah, why not? I'm going to keep the beef for later. You feel better, but still peckish. Jesus Christ, this lady eats lots, doesn't she? Uh, why not? Have some beef then as well. You should be more than well fed. You are well fed. There we go. Um, so now we've got a big... Big belly of food, and uh, we've got some milk on our stomach, so why not add some wine? There we go. We are now feeling very stamina fullish. <laughs> Words are not my strong suit. Okay, so let's venture into Skyrim then. That was our room for the night. Oh, let's uh, off we go then uh, into the breach once more. Oh, some strawberries. You have to be on the lookout for stuff like that. Ah, snowberries or whatever. Anyway, I'm gonna leave it there, guys. Thanks for joining me, and I shall be back very soon with this. I shall try not to, like, freeze to death. I can't, I can't be idle when I'm in the middle of nowhere. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. Hit like and subscribe, and I'll catch you next time. Ciao!